Welcome to Viral Crime Vlog. You already know what the channel is all about. We give you first-hand information based on viral crime and latest happenings. Stay tuned. Family of slain girl explains decision to allow sex offender suspect to stay on their property. The family of Audrey Cunningham explains their decision to allow the man accused of murdering her to live on their property, citing a loophole in the sex offender registration system that obscured his past conviction. Audrey, aged 11, was tragically found dead last week, having been last seen with Don Stephen McDougall, 42, who resided on the family's property and frequently transported her to school. McDougal faces capital murder charges in connection with Audrey's death, according to the family. They conducted a background check on McDougal before permitting him to reside in an old camper on their premises, but his prior conviction for enticement of a child did not surface on the sex offender registry. Expressing regret over the lack of knowledge about McDougal's past, the family asserts that they would never have allowed him near their property or their daughter had they been aware of his history. Details about McDougal's previous incarceration were not disclosed by the family, who were unavailable for further comment. McDougal's conviction dates back to a 2007 incident wherein he assaulted Carissa Davis when she was 10 years old. Davis, now an adult, believes that McDougal's short prison sentence contributed to Audrey's tragic fate. McDougal remains in custody without bail in Polk County, with his legal representation unclear at this time.